Better shake your booties for black girl nerds. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds. Good. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Great. Good. <laughs> so, with WandaVision, which we all loved, tonally, is Fantastic Four going to be kind of similar to what we saw with WandaVision? I mean, WandaVision was such a unique thing. You know, it was sitcoms and dealing with grief that, you know, it's hard to compare anything to WandaVision. Yeah. This is its own unique story. Uh, retro future 60s, Marvel's first family. I'm sure there'll be some things that cross over, and just because there are things that I'm interested in stylistically, but they are very different. And with working in, with an ensemble cast such as this one, it's kind of challenging because everybody's kind of vying for their own moment. So how was it navigating working with an ensemble cast such as this? I mean, they're all amazing actors, and I think one of the things that makes amazing actors amazing is generosity. I mean, being a great actor is being open to the other people, right? And so I think they've all vibe with each other beautifully, and they're really working like a family. It's awesome. Yeah. Would you say that there are kind of like some similar plot twists that we'll expect that we kind of experience with WandaVision in Fantastic Four? Uh, well, I wouldn't want to say too much about our plot. We do have our surprises, but I want to keep them under wraps. Well, thank you, Matt, so much for talking to Black thank Girl Nerds. Appreciate yeah, it. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds.